Alexis, or AKA Princess Mononoke. Oh, is that your costume? Yes. So tell us about your costume. Uh, dedicated to Miyazaki's films, uh, Princess Mononoke. So just wanted to dress up and do this. <laughs> so all handmade. Awesome. So yeah. we're asking the question, are you the ultimate pop up fan? Yes, I am. <laughs> tell us why. Uh, because I believe it creates uh, readers to be their own person and to grow up and become heroes. So it's an inspiration, and I like that. I'm the ultimate comic book fan because I believe comics inspire us to do great things in the world. I think I've always been a believer in what Captain America is always about, and I believe that together through comics, we can very, make great changes in society. And it's a fun thing too. Comics, they bring all kinds of art and creativity out of people, and they inspire people to do great things. And I just love seeing all the creativity that goes on at Comic Cons. I've been going to Comic Cons for several years here, up in Seattle, over in Toronto, and it's just a blast. Okay, so we're looking for the ultimate comic book fan. Are you the ultimate comic book fan? I am definitely the ultimate comic book fan. We've been collecting for 30 years. I've gone to every Comic Con since 1996 without, with except for four, because I'm in the Navy. Two deployments, so I went to Iraq and then I decided to break myself. But at one time I was getting 70 titles a month, 70 different titles a month, and uh, my house is full of comic books, my parents' house is full of comic books, my entire house is plastered with comic posters. So yeah, I, I, I bleed comic books. I am a huge Spider Man. X-Men, Flash, Legion of Superheroes fan, DC, Marvel, Silver Age, Golden Age, Modern Age, you name it. If I could afford every comic book and have a place to put it, I would own it and have it. Couldn't be a bigger fan. My wife hates it. Why? <laughs> because there's only so much space and money to go around. So, why am I the biggest comic book fan? It's always going to be a part of my life. It'll never go away.